I've always dreamt of a man courting me the right way. And now that I found my prince, I'm ready to find my castle. Husband Brad is fine with a castle, so long as it doesn't put his money in the moat. Hi, I'm Jen. This is my husband Brad, and I work as a wedding planner. And I work as a uh, stay-at-home husband. I actually just left my job so I can keep things tidy around the house for Jen. <laughs> Realtor Kim is hoping to get Jen exactly what she wants while staying on budget. Uh, she hired me back when she was 17, so she's had a, a lot of time to plan this out. So this is the master bathroom. As you can see, it's well appointed. Oh no, I, I, I literally hate how that turns both ways. I can't deal with that. Next, what else do we have? This is disgusting. Does the toilet at least heat up? No, 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 no. Can Realtor Kim work her magic? I've done. Thanks. I can't. No, I hate this. Or will their low budget stop them from high dreams? I've wanted my dream house since I was a little girl. I would literally sell my wedding ring if it got me within budget. She sold mine, so she uh, knows exactly where to go. You wouldn't actually do that though, right? Oh, here is a picture of us on our wedding night. Oh, yeah. This is probably the highest point in your life so far, huh? Yeah, I never really thought of it like that. Yeah. Jen was looking for a nice guy to mesh with her passive aggressive behavior and combative personality. All my girlfriends said that he was the one when he refilled both of our wine glasses during the Sex and the City marathon night. The next day, I told him to get down on both knees and propose. This good? Now married, they're looking to find the perfect dream home where Jen can drain the life out of her husband on a daily basis. My must-haves include a larger outdoor space for photo shoots. I'm planning on starting a fashion blog. <laughs> Honey, I thought you already showered. Not yet. My must-haves include a private place for me to Okay, a so we've been approved for $99,500. So there is no excuses that Kim can't find us something perfect. No excuses. It's a pleasure to meet you. Nice to meet you. Oh, excellent. So I'm so excited to work with you both. I think you have some great ideas. Uh, based on your budget, are you guys open to some fixer uppers? Uh, I heard Brad is an excellent handyman. I just fixed him. Ooh, if I have a handy husband, I don't know about. Please let me know. <laughs> 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 you two are a scream. Well, I do hope we find a home that you guys will both love. Totally, totally. <laughs> or just me. I mean, I can swap them out like a day at the kitchen appliance. <laughs> <laughs> so with our budget, I'm looking for an open concept home in the Beverly Hills slash West LA area with new appliances. Um, hardwood throughout, what else do I want? His and her sinks, oh, and a yoga room facing east for my morning routine. I feel like this is the perfect neighborhood. I like the grass, <laughs> San Augustine. It's a lot easier to maintain than Bermuda. Whatever they decide on, they're in agreement that it has to be an updated interior because this bitch likes to spend. I really like that one. I could totally picture myself living in there. Do you think it's within budget? Oh, I'm not sure, sweetie. Can you imagine how happy I would be every single night when I came home? Just a thought. Oh, look, it has a three-car garage. I could park off the street a couple nights a week. Oh, as long as I don't have friends over, of course. I think you guys are really going to like this space. It's an open concept. Uh, hey, don't you think I should get my own bedroom this time? I've been sleeping in a coat closet since the wedding and the draft gets pretty harsh at night. Although I, I read online that it's good for your sleep cycle to be in complete darkness and cold, so the no windows thing may be good for me. God, you're so caring, dude. This is a kitchen and needs yeah, some work, right. but it definitely has storage. See? Mm -hmm. um, and also, uh, what do you think? I mean, it has everything you're looking for. It's certainly within budget. Jen also hates cabinets that are spaced too close together because they give feelings of entrapment. Can we knock this down? 
I need to see the street from the sink. Yes, of course. Mm -hmm. Can the newlyweds find the home Jen wants? It's been six months since we closed. Jen had some pretty tight demands, but I think we... <gasps> Kim, you bitch! Come in, come in. Come on. <laughs> so, did we find a good fit? Oh, I sure did. It's everything I've ever wanted. Wine. Oh, please. <sighs> So, uh, how's Brad? Uh, is he like in the new space? Oh, he's outside or something. Oh, one, one second. Okay, I'm good. So we, uh, we got the house. Really excited. Jen loves it. It's really expensive, but we're gonna make it work. I've been sleeping in my car, um, not because I'm not allowed to sleep inside or anything, but just because I've been picking up some extra jobs to make a living selling phone memory cards to people door to door and been driving a uh, Uber and Lyft and I, uh, I've been selling some supplements and also some, uh, some phone books. So if you guys ever need anything, let me know. I can get a coupon code for you, 10% off. But uh, we're really excited for this new life that we're going to be living in California. Cheers to me. Cheers.